25日の夜が必要だっただから試験の会で彼が死んだように見せかけ出しってこと Hello, people of YouTube. My name is Steve Gray. Thank you for watching. Today, we're talking about Tower of God Season 2, Episode 12. I believe we only have one episode left. I keep looking, trying to figure out the episode account because I've seen some say 12, some say 13, and some say 24. But when I search how many episodes the Season 2 of Tower of God had, it seems to be coming up with 13. So, unfortunately, only one episode left after this one. Uh, so, we have the clip here that I showed, and、uh, Kuhn is going to team up with Veal's or Bam's new teammate.、Uh, we do have 100% confirmation that、uh, Veal is Bam now. So, there we go. <laughs> That's over.、Uh, they needed to think he was dead because they were, apparently they were actually trying to kill him.、Uh, the reason they were trying to kill him is because Bam is an irregular. Uh, only irregulars have the ability to kill Zahard, which is like the king of the tower,、uh, and they want him to do that.、Uh, so that is why they were, are essentially they're trying to hide him. They don't want people knowing his actual identity because then more pe- he'll have more heat on him and more and more people will try to kill him that are higher ranks、um, and you know, higher up the、uh, ladder, if, if you will. But at the same time, I feel like. What they're doing right now is not helping him <laughs> at all either. So I don't fully understand the logic、uh, in all of that. But、uh, Rune, the girl with the eye patch there, kind of explains it in that she doesn't really know what's happening now because, like, Foob members just seem to not be loyal to one another unless they're higher up for some reason. So we have higher ups having Veal join their team and a couple of Coon's old teammates joining that team as well. But I think. Essentially, all of them are ultimately on the same team. You know, it's, 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 all, it's just kind of like the two, two or three separate teams coming together.、Um, Dan is still alive.、Uh, Rachel sadistically took Dan's legs away、um, because, you know, she, apparently she, for a short period of time, lost her leg function. And now she's like, now you're going to learn how to do it too、uh, in a very sadistic way and purposely kept Dan alive. Thinking that he was going to be all crying and pitiful and everything else. And then he just straight up said, Hey, Coon, take me to the,、uh, the battle、uh, on the 30th floor, where you know, they're going to get a bunch. Hopefully, they're going to get some rare items and, and be able to continue、uh, through the tower. So it'll be interesting to, to see what happens there. I'm guessing that's what's going to be next episode is basically everybody meeting up again.、Um, Dan, I don't know if Dan wants to kill Rachel or not, but he definitely wants to show her what he can do without his legs. Because I don't know if his legs are completely useless now、uh, or what. If he's going to be like in a wheelchair. I mean, obviously, right now he can't do anything, but he's alive. Maybe he'll heal up and be fine, but、uh, only time will tell. So I will leave it there.、Um, cool episode overall. We'll give it like an 8 out of 10 because there's some confusion there. Because, of, because, as I said, if they're trying to get the heat. Off of Bam and call him something else because they don't want people knowing he's an irregular, then why are they saying, oh, he killed one of them, having him join this organization or, pret- or pretend because he's, he's not willingly joining the Foog?、Um, why would they have him join that to put more heat on him and then say he killed、uh, one of the members of the Ten Families to put even more heat on him? If they're trying to keep him alive to get to the you know, 100th floor or wherever the heck Zahart is. Uh, why, I don't understand why the heck they would willingly do that. That does not make sense to me. But、uh, yeah, so maybe we'll get some better explanation. Maybe I'm thinking of something that I shouldn't. I know they want him to be significantly stronger, obviously, because I'm assuming Zahard being the king of the tower is super OP,、um, and that would make sense. But、uh, we'll just have to wait and see what happens.、Uh, until next time, subscribe, notification bell, like, share, comment, all that fun stuff. And as always, Have a good one.